Hello Flo fam and welcome to yet another episode of Vlogmas. Today is going to be like the ultimate Christmas vlog because um, let me just show you outside. It snowed all last night and this morning and I'm going to be preparing for our little Christmas party that we're having on Monday. It's just me, my cousins, my sisters, and my brother is going to be in town. So I need to go to the store and get stuff for that. I might make the Oreo balls like tonight. I've never made Oreo balls so hopefully I do a good job. But anyway, let's look forward to in today's vlog. If you guys are new, make sure to subscribe and turn on the post notifications. Let's get started. I'm ready now and I feel like it's gonna be really cold so I'm wearing a sweater with a hoodie and a jacket and a beanie. Hopefully I stay warm. I did not expect it to be this windy. Oh, oh there's no snow where I'm walking of course. Oh, oh the snow. I'm gonna go on the little walk, enjoy the snow. We love a good snowy day. It's like red. <sighs> That's my blush. Oh. <laughs> Should we check the mail? That's my point. Yay. I need gloves. When you keep gloves in your glove box. Yes. Hello. Hello. What's up? You are wearing not enough layers for the temperature outside. <laughs> oh, I know. <laughs> well, uh, I'll be nipping hard when we're walking to Walmart. So we just made it to Walmart. Enjoy our shopping trip. <laughs> This is the most packed I've ever seen Walmart. Now the jingle hop and we go. Jingle bell, jingle bell, jingle bell rock. Jingle bell time and jingle bell time. Dancing and dancing in jingle bells square. In the frosty air. So, look at this massive Rice Krispie treat. Wow. I don't know about you, but that was real funny to think about. Wow. but that was a very successful shopping trip. Why is there a trailer in the middle of the parking lot? Uh, we got so much stuff, but much needed for our Christmas party. And now we're gonna go get Cafe Rio because we're all starving. We finally just got back to Dallas Nelly's and we were in line at Cafe Rio for an hour. So for our Christmas party, we got lots of snacks and we got sweaters because we're gonna make our own ugly Christmas sweaters. So let me just show you. They only had, um, Really big sizes. So Ellie got a 4X and I got a 2X. I think everyone's making Christmas sweaters because they were just all sold out. But honestly, it's such a vibe. <laughs> so let me show you all the stuff we got to decorate. We got like these twisty things, these like balls, some more balls, glitter, we got bows. So yeah, it's definitely gonna be fun. And that video is gonna be posted Tuesday because our party's Monday, so stay tuned. Okay, so this is my first time making Oreo balls it's for the party on Monday. So I don't have, a, or I guess Ellie doesn't have giant Ziploc bags, so I'm going to smush them in a Walmart bag and see how this goes. Do they not have a roller? I just stabbed holes in Yeah, the I was about to say, a fork is not in the move. I now have the tools. Okay, that just smushed them immediately. That worked out way better. I'm just gonna roll it like it's red. Ooh. Yay! Now I need to do that with all the Oreos. <laughs> I wonder if putting them in a blender would be better. Honestly, it wouldn't turn them into juice, would it? <laughs> <laughs> Sydney. I think we might just put them in a blender. Wow. All right, we'll see how this goes. Okay, that is way more like what I needed. Like <laughs> this versus this. <laughs> now we add the thing I hate the most. Cheese, cheese of cream. I'm so excited. You look very excited. I look scared because I hate cream cheese. Get out, get out. Get out me trap house. It's all over my hands. Oh my gosh, why is this so difficult? There we go. 
Fun. We're gonna use a hand mixer and we're having issues. Oh, 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 no way. Well, um, no issues anymore. <laughs> I'm scared of these things. I didn't get enough cream cheese, so shout out to Ellie for having more. Now, I'm just balling the Oreo balls. Oh, I thought you, do you not cook them? No. no. Oh, making everyone on YouTube jealous, jealous, jealous. Oh yeah, they're actually so easy to make. So I put them in the freezer, but the pan had to go like this because the freezer's too thin, and they all rolled onto each other. So I'm just gonna put them on plate. Let it snow, let it snow. We're currently playing a game where you have to argue each other based on what character you get and then what superpower or negative power that you have, so enjoy. I'm Hillary Clinton and I'm nine feet tall. Okay, um, going up again. to show you guys my options. <laughs> We've got E.T., the Statue of Liberty, or a mummy. Statue of Liberty. I think I'm gonna go with Statue of Liberty. That's actually pretty OP. And... I can only see movement, and that's actually an upgrade because before I couldn't see at all because I'm a statue. <laughs> so I can see you coming from a mile away. You're nine feet tall. <laughs> you destroy one of America's monuments. Boom! You're gone. You're nine feet tall. Can you even move? You you can't no, move. No, but I can see you coming. How is that? So how, how would you defend yourself? <laughs> you just watch me be like, oh, okay. Because I'm She's a statue, nine feet tall. and there's like always tourists around me. And they protect me. I because can tell. America. I can like quarantine the area to be Boy, like nobody no. can go there, and I'm blowing it up. You actually can't because you're nine feet tall. That is body shaming. <laughs> <laughs> All right. You, you can't even move. <laughs> I'm a Statue of Liberty. I don't need, actually. I have moved. I came from the place I was made to America. Yeah, France. France. So I'll do it again. Bop, bop. Okay, right. Dallin wins. <laughs> no, I vote Sid. Let's go. <laughs> I have an assassin. Oh, have... a saber tooth tiger. I don't know. I'm a trained killer. Yeah, if I can of kill, humans. Yeah, I'm if I can human. kill a human who's like smart and like uses their brain. I could easily kill a tiger. Do you know the only reason these are OP? Their because entire existence <laughs> is to kill things. So he's an assassin! No, he has to like eat, he has to go talk to his mom, he has so to go text his tigers. mom. Yeah, they text their mom. They have to eat. Yeah, because they kill the people they eat. I'm a trained like, assassin, like I can be sneaky. Predator. <laughs> Alpha predator. Assassin. Alpha predator. Assassin. Alpha predator. Assassin. <laughs> Do you guys have your votes? <laughs> Sid. Sid. Yes. I didn't want to be tigers were extinct a million years ago for a reason. <laughs> <laughs> they're still around today, and I was like, well, they're, they're not. They're not. They're not. I was gonna say the only saber tooth tiger I know is from Ice Age. Hey, so. I am. He's too nice. He's Iron nice. Man. Who? I am Iron Man, and I know kung fu. Well, I'm the Statue of Liberty. What are you going to do with your Kung Fu? I'm sorry. I'm okay, that's it for our Saturday night shenanigans. So, see you guys probably tomorrow. Bye. So cold. Hello, everyone. It is the next day now, and my brother is coming into town today, so we're about to go pick him up from the airport. I haven't seen him in forever because he lives in Kauai, which is difficult to get to. So, I'm very excited for him to come visit. And, yes. I am pretty much wearing the same thing as yesterday, but I have a black shirt on underneath and I'm wearing green socks, so I'm wearing like Christmas colors. Let's get going because I should have left like five minutes ago. So I was thinking about the last time we saw Jordan. I think it was literally my mom's wedding back in March. So it's been a long time. And his girlfriend Rachel is coming with him, so we're gonna pick them both up. And I think he's staying in a hotel tonight and then he's gonna stay at Dallas and Ellie's because they have a guest room. I think it's the plan, but we're gonna have a really fun week, lots of fun stuff, and then we're all flying back to Missouri together, and then we're going to my mom's together, and then we all disperse from there. So basically what I'm saying is the holiday madness is starting today.
this is caught. <laughs> <laughs> when your subs are too big. <laughs> so Jordan and Rachel are staying in this really nice fancy hotel tonight. So let me just show you what it looks like. Mostly just show you the view. Pretty nice. And we got Subway. And I got a oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Down got some chocolate milk. Very little chocolate milk. <laughs> <laughs> That's the only one they had. So we've just been back at the apartment. Um, Jordan and Rachel are like exhausted from their travels, so they're just gonna chill at their hotel tonight. We've been watching movies, laying in bed, and I've seen this TikTok trend, and if you guys haven't seen it, well, just consider me your mother of TikTok if you don't have TikTok, and I will shed some light on the TikTok things. So basically, I show you what it's like to be 5'1", and then Dallin will show you what it's like to be six foot. So, here we go. So, 5'1 person getting out of bed. Can't touch the floor. Must be nice. This is how close the sink is. This is eye level of my closet. If I want to get a hoodie, gotta stand on my tippy toes. Closet. The shower is really far away. Shower. Here is the doorway and the hall. The fridge at eye level. The microwave. Microwave. And the oven. Oven. That's gonna be it for today's vlog this episode. Kind of like chill, Christmas vlog, snowed, getting ready for the party tomorrow. Woo. And yeah, we'll see you guys in the next one. Subscribe for you. Okay, bye.